Can you explain to him before we got on, actually start? We haven't started yet. Oh. No, no, we haven't started. Well, I mean, we can let it roll and then we just edit out. But like, do you understand? Like, I, I, if I, in case we leave this in, like, I explained yesterday on the group chat, like, what were the instructions? Yeah, yeah. I, un I understand that you don't want to. You understand cut, I understand that you don't want to cut a lot, but like, like I said yesterday, if there is anything, You're right, like me, me and Howard should be able to say, actually, no, we don't want that in there. Because oh, if yeah, it's something yeah. that we want to do regularly, it's something I would like to do regularly. I don't, fine, want, I don't want to think onto that first episode and be like, no, I don't want to do that. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, welcome to the first episode of today's podcast on the Inzingy channel. I'm not sure of the name yet. It will be in the title. It most likely will be clickbait. Um, we are, have our two guests here, the, the OGs of the channel, if you are familiar. Probably not. You're probably new to the channel. Subscribe, like, hit notification bell. Zachary, I don't know what your middle name is, <laughs> Gone, and Howard Enos. Christopher Pinkra, former owner of ZKG, very popping channel, of course, and doing extremely well. <laughs> and your story? How is just how oh, is just here? Just really really <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going I'm to just here for the money. <laughs> there is no money. Oh, yeah. Believe me, there is no money in this. There's your CPM down. is. Okay, <laughs> diss tracks. That's one way to transition into this straight away. Um, have they finished? I don't know. I don't think it got to a point, didn't you think? Like with the whole Deji and KSI thing, that it was like it went too far. Like it went, it went personal. So I don't know. I, th I think the thing with that ish, with that whole area, is that yes, it, it was something that should never have been brought online. There were clearly some underlying family issues there, which which should have stayed um, personal. But yeah, I, I, Deji I, just I'm, had to bring it out. I understand yeah. why Deji did have to release it. I think it yeah, online. that it all sprouted from that thing that like. On the, what was it, Fortune video? on the side Yeah, of the, the family fortune. I don't think it was that bad. You saying, I'm a dead channel. That's just like taking a piss out of your mates like, as a joke. But you think from Deji's point, he's got his brother standing literally right there. His mates just call him a dead channel. Yeah, it's it's not really that much of an yeah. insult. But like, but I think you, you, like you, you, can, you was, can see where Deji's coming from. It was from. building up, I think. I think that like, he's been treated mm. like shit because it's Deji. Like, it's just... It's just, it's just Dej, Dej has been bitched about as as long time viewers of the comedy shorts game channel. <laughs> and as we saw uh, in the fight, we have seen Deji about. receive his fair fair amount of bitch bitching. So there's not much to talk about on that. I I don't the, the new song was what? called Beerus. Yeah, but that wasn't a diss track. It was a diss track, but I I no, saw in the comments people were confused about like, no no no. Apparently that they they actually, cleared yeah. up though because I did hear that song on Snapchat ages ago, like as in like a few months ago. But some of the lines in there, I think they amended it around that because he said stuff like probably, but I some mean, of the, realistically, the, the, the what this is were there. I mean, there's they were. nothing that the internet's going they were just, crazy they were just about. Talking it's just about another average song. They were talking about haters and like people that online are just talk shit and then don't do anything. So it's just um, is that literally all that? Thing was about that whole video. Yeah, basically, it's about it's about like him being like they were correct, they were creating him that sort of thing. Like that's from Dragon Ball Z. Mm. I didn't watch it that much, but my cousin's into it not a lot. Yeah. But yeah, that's like he's he's, he's he does have a he, like I know what you mean by the god complex thing. But he said, do you watch behind the scenes? Nah. Basically, it's one, on, 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 the on Randall's like, channel, like and he's basically saying that like, he just does it to trigger people. Like he's, he doesn't, he doesn't actually think he's god. He said that KSI thinks he's a god, and then JJ is just a normal mm. man. Is it like as if they're two different personas almost? Well, yeah, is it, yeah, is it KSI is is the on, is the online god? Just like you have, but, but JJ's the guy that's behind. Just like you that, have that portrays that character. The Inzingi presence, and then the one that you do know, which is obviously a well mannered man. <laughs> I have to say the. <laughs> The the Inzingi what's what's the word for it? Persona. The Inzingi persona is um, very very family friendly, I must say, <laughs> compared to what Josh Rissing is like. The Inzingi persona is very a, family. A man friendly. of the public eye, wouldn't you say? Nah. So it, so it all kicked off, obviously, based on that Family Feud video yeah. where Deji, you know, if if you don't know, Deji's chan channel got called um, was it his channel got called Deads by a uh, Randolph yeah. I don't, He definitely didn't say malicious, maliciously no, he, he was like, oh... It, it wasn't maliciously, like, you could tell it was a bit of banter, but obviously Deji took that to heart. And then, what, hap what happened next? He... And then, De 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 no, then Deji made a video Deji saying, made the video, yeah. Complaining. Yeah. And then like he said about his wife, he said, you are a bitch, yeah, you're JJ's bitch. Yeah. Which was, I actually thought it was, it was funny, but he was actually serious though. He was not, he was like mad, yeah. And to be honest, everyone was still spectacle if it was fake or not. But I don't... But then I didn't see it as fake because there wasn't any like. No, no. I think 
a, a lot of the times with all the diss tracks that come out, there is that little point, there yeah, is that little bit of little like, bit, yeah. oh, it might be fake, it might not, and then all of a sudden it gets down the line, you're like, nah, that's not fake. Yeah, yeah. I think everything that's, that has been done is all real, I just think they've done certain things just to boost views and while they're at it, like just diss tracks. Certain it? things, yeah, yeah, like for instance, we, we're, jump, we're jumping down the timeline here, but when Deji released his Unforgivable track with Dax, yeah, yeah. Crypts, and what's his cameraman? Jallo. Jallo. Mm. Is that all of them? Do you rate Jallo? Yeah. It, it was it's it's sick flow. I'm not gonna lie, like it's not something I could do. It is decent flow for a cameraman I'm just a as well. That's how you start to. I can't. think I think the beat is wavy though. The beat is quite hard. I'm yeah. not gonna lie. Dax goes in. Dax is a fucking machine. I, I actually don't know why Dax is doing that. I mean, I, I, he's only like, doing it to boost like, his career. Yeah, like like he said in the the kill, in the kill shot video. Yeah, he is actually a rapper. Like he is actually a sick rapper, and he will be he'll make it like a year. Yeah, definitely. Like because he, he has got that mainstream kind of aura yeah. about him. He, he just looks like a rapper. Just look at him. Yeah, he yeah. looks like an ex or something. I don't like know. if that if that man come down the alley. <laughs> oh, you're 12, 12 at night. That's why you're running. That's would lick me up, fam. And then what happened from there? Then uh, obviously Randolph is his first diss track. I'm looking back at it now. I don't think it was that good. It's for Randolph's first one. But I, 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 do you know what I think about Randolph? Yeah, I'm not saying he's bad. No, I think right? both of them were. Quite I, I good. actually, I, I actually think in terms of if you're looking at hip hop in general, then Randolph's awful. Yeah, but if you're on about actual YouTube rappers, then he's all right. But it's just his voice. I can't use. I, I get what you're saying, but I think when you're when you're look, when you're looking at a rapper, you will, you do in a diss track mainly is when you do need to be looking at the bars that they are saying. Yeah, just the disses. When, like, for example, in Beerus, it's just it's just a music video, just you know a normal song. I think then that is yeah. when. Things like your voice and your personality and all yeah, that no, sort yeah. of stuff. JJ really makes video. Matter. JJ actually makes like songs that like you can listen to. Like not like he he hardly puts this in them. That's the thing. Like he's, it's mainly just like songs you can just vibe to. Like, but that but what songs like. has he like? Slow motion. That was pretty sick. That, that was all right. Uncontrollable. Uncontrollable was was all right. Right. It wasn't really a diss track. Was, was, was it? Yeah. The one where it's like a black and white video. Yeah, yeah, that one. The one with Big Zoo. Yeah. yeah. Honest opinion. What are your ratings on KSI's music? I think yeah that then this is the thing and you do I don't know if you do understand yeah but his actual lyrics yeah because he actually because I've noticed because I, I looked at some of his lyrics he studies a bit like what Kendrick Lamar does yeah obviously nowhere near as good but his lyrics are good but he just needs to focus on like just actually trying to just sound good to about to main like people but like, it just me you yeah like I don't think he's he's he's, he's underrated a little bit I th I think um, the only reason the music does do so well is because he does already have that platform. Which, which, fair enough, he's built the platform which he now has, he can yeah. basically branch off and do whatever he wants. Yeah. Realistically, he's got that many subscribers. No, but like, he's, fans, I don't he think can, he's done he that bad. Do like, there's some YouTubers that done diss tracks like, like a year ago, like Chris MD or someone, or just some YouTuber, or JMX, and they're, they're so awful. Like, don't, you think, don't you think because of like the diss track season, like and how every like remember like how bad it was like last year. Yeah. Well, that, was all, year, that, was like, that was all fake. That was all fake. That was all fake. Sidemen, you got us. You got our ad revenue. Fair play to you. Don't you think that and that put Jacob like Logan. um what's the word? Like a damper on like how we like respect like them sort of rappers. Cause like yeah, cause yeah, like yeah, for definitely. me like I, like. When I just hear what I was rap like this is just, 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 just it's, yeah and, and all the I mainstream rappers that don't like it because yeah. it's, like, it's not real rap it's just but I don't think they're, they're taking it too seriously mm. I think but then then, then again you got someone like JJ literally calling himself a god and it's like mm. no. but like we were saying earlier if that is for his character yeah that is for his character that, though as we see as we that see. then you know because pe people who don't like other people that spreads a lot quicker so yeah back back to our original point Deji didn't like. Didn't like what Randolph said about him. Randolph drops a diss track. Deji dropped one back. Deji dropped one. Hiding like his hiding Anne. like his Anne, you know, because Holocaust the jokes are funny. No, they're really not. They they literally that's why PewDiePie like just teared down the platform like a few years ago with the Nazi jokes. But anyway, we're not gonna go into that. We're a family friendly channel here. Um, but yeah, what happened then from there? Then uh, obviously Rand came out and then. Randolph released his second one and he baited them out like, like victory I, speech was yeah, a victory, yeah, victory speech yeah victory speech yeah was so like hard like as in terms of like not, not forget just like it sounded alright yeah it's all right track but I mean the actual diss is like he went in like saying like basically calling him a pedo like got in, like really? the girls messages and stuff like that with the voice messages because I I think I remember as well yeah, Ra out. Randolph did get into a little bit of an alter altercation with uh, Crypt 
Yeah, yeah, crypt, right, so crypt, yeah, I, I, I've never heard of him literally until he came into this, so he's, he's, yeah. he actually got a little bit of fame from that, yeah. Do you know, but it, it's, it's fair enough. Everyone got so much fame from this, like Randolph, he gained like 250k subs just from all this beef. Well, I mean, I mean, look at that, Randolph reacting to another diss track on me, 980k views. So you and think that, that's if he was just reacting to any other diss track, it, it wouldn't have got that much. Yeah, exactly. He's oh, oh yeah, that's it, that's it. Because uh, they were talking about crypt on the podcast. Crypt didn't release a full diss track, he released a warning track. Yeah, Do you warning. Yeah, I, don't, I don't think that, I think he sounds, maybe it's because we're not American, I think he sounds so weird. Yeah, like, to, to say a warning like, track, um, no, was, no, I, that, I, did, I did watch Randolph react to it and he was like, if it's if you're dissing me in it, just call it a diss track. There's no point yeah. calling it a warning, just call it a diss track. Can yes, just, yes, you're not going to your full potential. Like, just just show him one of his videos. I, I know, apparently, yeah, like the way he writes is sick, but he's... Well look, this, this was his warning track that he did for him. He, he's basically like a fat old Randall. Why is Cheek so red? This is like a I'm not gonna answer. Wait, um, I think, I well, I think what we need to go on here is Social Blade and just analyse. Yeah, th I mean, it, to be honest, it worked out for all of them. But it wasn't fake. It wasn't fake, but it did, it did all benefit all their channels. Who the fuck is this guy? Because basically, Crypt was just a little bit butt hurt that he didn't get mentioned in the podcast. Yeah, but realistically, yeah. that's 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 what the track was. But to us, if I was naming YouTube rappers, I would not mention him either because I don't. Even, I watch a lot of YouTube. But, but that's but that's basically just what, what I knew I who Dax check was. Here. I knew Dax was before Dax was a bit of like in the thing, but I did not know who this guy was. Like he's just like, some why, guy why that's just can't find mentioned. Crypt? Like, I don't think his channel is big enough to be on Social Blade. No, he'll be on Social Blade. What are you on about? No, he will. Everyone's on Social Blade. He's got 318k. How, what are right, you on about? I can't find it. He's boosted his subs. Jesus. All right, just into, uh, what what you have from there? And then from there, he, he he dissed a lot of things he said. And then also at the end of Victory Speech, he made a diss towards Crypt. Like a, He had like a few bars. It was quite sick. We went fast flowing. Because mm. basically Crypt said that he can't rap fast. So Randolph showed a bit of his skills. Was all right. Wasn't the best, but there's a one track. Then Renat ran off his victory speech. We just said, and then at the end he took a dig at Crypt. Yeah, and then, yeah. And then that, and then that was it between them two, wasn't it? Yeah, that was it between them two. And then, and then also, uh, Jay and uh, Deji made a video like reacting to it, yeah, and stuff, and saying, oh, oh yeah, yeah, I'm not a pedo, yeah, and stuff like that. That was years ago. And then he was saying that, oh yeah, 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 oh, he yeah. Said, he said, oh, now, he's so yeah. dumb. Why would you say this about your brother? I'm just saying. He said that, oh, I didn't get a girl pregnant. My brother did. Yeah, yeah, everyone everyone already knew. Everyone yeah. already knew. Yeah, because you know Harry said it last year. Yeah, exactly. Track. That's why I didn't understand. Like I was looking through some of the comments and people saying, oh yeah, but. He he baited out his brother for having an abortion. We knew that it, from like, last year. Having I think it's because they, in he, the brought up, he brought up again, so it's like people. I don't know. Maybe then, I don't know. And then Calix fucking double hit it in his um Calix. his insults match, oh, yeah. saying um hands up for most amount. Of, <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Sure. for most amount. Of I, 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 remember I remember that. I remember that. Shout out to Calix. He's yeah, about Calix. Collab soon. Come on, mate. Oh, do you know so what do, wait, what do you think like, of, of their like, relationship now, uh, JJ and Thingy? Do you think like, I can? So I, 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 think, I, think it, I think it will get sorted out. So I watched a Jallo, think... um, I watched a Jallo vlog. Yeah, it's so weird because I don't ever watch him. But I just watched him to see. Yeah, and then uh, or maybe it was Deji's vlog, the recent one. And then he was saying, in, Deji was saying that he's gonna try to call his brother and not sort it out. So like he said, like, but it will probably take yeah. a few months. That's that's the thing. Like, it's it is gonna get sorted out. I mean, they're brothers. Like no, but like every family, like I've I've had things like in my life in my family where certain people just don't talk. But then it it will recover, but it will take a bit of time. It I does. Think. But you think being on the platform where they are every day, the question is gonna be, have you made up with your brother yet? Yeah. And all the people around him, have you made up with? He your should just yet? say that he has. Just say so he just doesn't get the stress from everyone. But yeah. But it's gonna be a, uh, it's gonna be an awkward Christmas if you're the Tunji <laughs> family. But I I don't think I mean Kodeka like he's uh, he I write him a lot but I don't I don't think there's gonna be anything more from him 